Hi everybody, I just got my brand new Ashbury base right here. I'm about to unpack it. Let's check it out. All right, there she is. That's the zipper. world's tiniest <laughs> upright base. I think it's great. The finish looks awesome. Okay, I got the strap put on here. And one of the weird things, and I, I did some reading on this um, on largesound.com, which is a website dedica dedicated to Ashbury bases and where I actually ordered this one. And one of the weird things about these little bases is kind of where the strap button is. You can see it right there on the top, which is strange, and the other button is here on the back of the neck, which is kind of a weird balance. So I just used my mandolin strap and went ahead and put it around the, the uh, neck, and uh, I haven't even tuned this up yet, but here it is plugged in. Alright, that sounds pretty awful, but let's go ahead and tune it up and see what we got. Okay, now that I've got these uh, thunder gut strings on here, I'm going to try... play a song. These are still stabilizing a bit as you can see. But they're coming together a lot faster than the original strings which are stretchier and take longer to break in. Um, and I do have the E wound backwards on purpose for a straighter pull. That's supposed to help it stay in the nut slot from what I've read online. Uh, this is the Slade Cleaves song. There's only one rule that you must take. So overall, so far so good. Uh, I'm definitely getting used to playing a fretless bass, which is not something I've really done before, so I'm going to have to get better at that. But I think the sound is really what I wanted, which is uh, basically the sound of an upright in this tiny little portable package. And uh, yeah, I'm excited.